Hello, this is going to be a short video on how to make Windows recognize a brand new hard drive. When you first install a brand new hard drive, it will not show up in, um, like if you were to click this PC, it would not show up as a storage device. You have to go in and initialize it, and you would always want to choose master boot record if, you're get, if your hard drive is under like two and a half terabytes. And uh, that just has to do with how many partitions you can break a drive up into. Um, for mass storage like this one terabyte drive, I just want it to be one big partition, just one big one terabyte drive. You could split it up into, you know, two 500 gig um, drives or, or whatever you wanted to, but I do it like this. Just use the whole thing. And then now we have to specify the volume size and assign it a drive letter so that Windows can recognize it as a storage drive. So it's basically just kind of point and click and um, make sure everything is set up the way you want it to. You want it to be a uh, NTFS file system, not FAT. And it takes me a minute to, to click on these buttons. If you look, it's 12.19 uh, in the morning while I'm doing this, so I'm a little slowed down. Okay, so right there, new volume E just popped up in the lower right-hand corner showing us Windows recognized our drive, and it's ready to use. So now we can just test it out. We'll close out File Manager, pull up this PC, and there it is. So there's our 120 gig SSD and our 1 terabyte storage drive. All ready to go. So I hope you enjoyed this quick little video and we'll see you next time.